Meghan Markle and Prince Harry were spotted in a sweet couple moment while attending Cirque du Soleil's latest artistic offering, Totem, at Royal Albert Hall last night. At one point, they reached over and grabbed each other's hand, making our hearts melt instantly. The show benefited Centerbeal, a charity that Prince Harry co-founded in 2006 that has a focus on offering mental health support for children and young people in Lesotho and Botswana who are affected by HIV. As a performer welcomed everyone, Harry reached out his hand for Meghan to hold, as seen in a video shared by the Rough Sussex Instagram page. They intertwined their fingers as they settled in to watch the daredevil and acrobatic talents. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have been pictured showing affection for each other throughout the course of their relationship. From warm pats on the back to kisses on the lips, these two are much more lovey-dovey compared to other royal couples in the family. Meghan has often been regarded as a breath of fresh air for the royals, and her fashion choices for the Cirque du Soleil date night reinforces this theory. The expecting mother stepped out in a sparkly navy dress with three-quarter length sleeves and a leg slip by Roland Moritz. She paired the glamorous dress with a Givenchy clutch and a gold bracelet that used to belong to the late Princess Diana. She also wore a bold, red lipstick, which is a different choice for the Duchess as she usually opts for neutral shades. While Meghan's appearance was certainly noteworthy, the main focus of the night was Harry's charity. They are not afraid to hold hands. They don't mind showing their emotions, veteran royal photographer, Mark Stewart, previously told People. Royal Etiquette expert Micah Meyer, founder and director of Beaumont Etiquette, previously told People that there are no formal rules on royal couples being lovey-dovey in public, it's at their own discretion. But the soon-to-be parents' decision to show their affection for each other is being welcomed by the public. Meghan and Prince Harry holding hands at a royal engagement is a refreshingly modern approach to their new role both as a couple and as representatives of the royal family, she said. Meghan, a newly minted royal style icon, sported a striking sequined, long-sleeved navy dress with a thigh-high slit from Roland Moritz. She accessorized with a pair of black high heels from Stuart Weitzman's nudist collection, a black satin Givenchy clutch and a special piece from Princess Diana's jewelry collection, a gold bracelet with blue stones. Husband Harry got the style memo and color coordinated in a navy suit with a clean white shirt, brogue shoes, and slate tie. Yesterday evening spectacle took place the shortly after Meghan's daytime visit to the Mayhew, a British animal welfare center where she showed plenty of love to rescue dogs. The organization is one of Meghan's four royal patronages. Welcome, top news today. Please subscribe and support this channel. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry head home after date night at Cirque du Soleil. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry enjoyed a date night at the theatre before they become a family of three. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex were guests of honour for the premiere of the Cirque du Soleil production Totem at the Royal Albert Hall. Meghan, 37, Dazzled in a sequined Roland Moore dress with a leg slit, worth £3,400, similar to an iconic gown Princess Diana was pictured in back in 1986. She complimented the outfit with her late mother-in-law's heirloom gold bangle, which features two dark-colored stones. The elegant bracelet was seen on Diana during an outing to an elderly people's home in Newham, East London, in 1990. Her black heels were a Stuart Weitzman design while her purse is a Givenchy jeweled clutch. The couple, who will welcome their first child in the sprint, were later spotted heading home in a car. Meghan, who revealed earlier this week she is six months pregnant, accompanied her husband to the performance, which will support a charity which supports children and young people affected by HIV in Southern Africa. The royal couple have met representatives of the Centre Bale charity, Cirque du Soleil and members of the cast. Meghan also paid tribute to Harry's late mum when she wore the bracelet during an engagement in Sydney with her husband last October. Meghan revealed this week she is around six months pregnant. It means her baby could share a birthday with his or her great-grandmother, the Queen, who turns 93 on April 21. Please like, comment, and subscribe to channel. Thank you for watching my video.